and we're back. Alright, I'm gonna avoid that place like the plague. I'm not going back down that basement. Because that's just stupid. Just stupid. Let's go upstairs this time. Ah, uh, nothing bad ever happens upstairs. Hello? What the hell is wrong with that guy's face? Bzz, bzz. Huh. He's like a like a monkey man. Uh sure. What's this? All notes? I can't read sheet music. Beep bop boop beep beep bop beep, beep. Oh shit. Spirits didn't like that too much. <laughs> oh god. Oh, what the fuck? Something bad is in there. Oh, what's going on over there? Been working all night. Don't wake me up. Can't wake up. Wake me up inside. Oh. Da, 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 new face of music. A night at the opera becomes a night to remember. Blah blah. blah night and uh, not be a house. Okay. Might not be a household uh, name yet, but just give her time. The incredibly talented multi instrumentalist gave an outstanding performance last night, winning over even the most ardent naysayers. She was simply outstanding. I haven't seen such passion, energy, and skill in years, stated famed pianist Daniel Richter. He was not alone in his praise. It seems that even Anthony Giles, one of the blah, harshest critics, has finally seen the light. Giles has, uh, Giles? Giles? Has previously made disparaging comments about the artist stating that there is more to performing music than enthusiasm and a pretty face. When asked if after wit witnessing last night's performance he regrets these words, Mr. Giles gave us a look that, that can only be described as a mixture of awe and embarrassment. Pressed for an answer, he simply said, yes, we caught up with the star. Uh, I don't know. Okay. Sure. Uh, nothing there. Nothing there. Okay, so... I guess my wife is a musician? It's, I guess I'm a painter. She's a musician. But where is she? What was this? Galactic's grand opening in flames. Disastrous fire at the new department store leaves dozens fighting for their lives. The long-awaited opening of the Galactic department store turned into hell on Earth when the building's wiring burst into flames. While the majority of the visitors managed to reach the emergency exits in time, several unfortunate attendees were trapped in the back of the building, having no chance to escape the raging inferno. The exact number of casualties has not yet been determined, although it is estimated that at least a dozen people have been severely injured. The owner of the Galactic, Ronald Sheffield, Sheffield, has so far declined to comment on today's tragic events. Oh, jeez. Well. That's not good. That is not good. Oh, I can't open that. Beep, boop, boop. What's this? Sorry, couldn't sleep. The leg's been acting up again. Figured I might as well do some work. Love you. 
Ah, is that my cane? Hasha! Alright. Sure. Oh god damn it, that scared me. Oh shit. <laughs> Fuck. Oh, that made me jump. Damn. Scree bottles. Man. The nerve. Okay. Doesn't look like there's anything in here. Stumbling all around, stumbling all around, stumbling all around. Sheepity poppity poo. Alright. I'm gonna go over here to where this door swung open. Let's see what's up. Oh, it's the, uh, the picture of the monkey man. Nothing in there. Nothing in there. What about in here? Any inch Ooh, what's that? True story behind the picture of Dorian Gray. Was it true all along? <gasps> Who knows? Who friggin' knows? I can't. Nothing. Nothing in there. Turn that on. It's a little dark in here. A ladder fell. So I guess this is my office. It looks like an... The fuck? Oh. It's glass. There's glass there. Oh, it's a key. Let's look in these drawers first. Oh, my dear friend, let me ask you one simple question. Have you completely lost your goddamn mind? I know you're going through some rough times right now. I really do. That's why I have agreed to let you do those illustrations in the first place. For old time's sake, I even deliberately gave you a trivial task because I expected Little Red Riding Hood to be something you can draw in your sleep. What I didn't expect is to get this demented nightmare fuel you submitted for a kid's bedtime story. There is no way in hell I am using this, and I already regret agreeing to a payment in advance. Please, get your shit together. Your old pal, Liam Brickstone. Whispered Tale Publishing House. Oh. So I like to make scary pictures. What's wrong with the scary pictures? That's not too bad. Oh. Okay. Alright, I get it. Yes, I get it. Uh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Just, that's not fitting for children. I understand. I'm sorry, I'll make it up to you tonight. It's all about you and me. Let's make it special. You promise. Got a key. My phone go. Phone's gone. Uh, yeah. Hey, wolf man. Alright, got the key. Let's get the show on the road. What's in that room over there? Oh God. <laughs> Hello? Oh man, this place is creepy as sin. I guess I have a daughter. Oh. Hey buddy. Good Lord. So many toys. So where's, where's my little girl? Oh, a fight? That one's staring at me. It's creeping me out. 
Let's open these drawers. Boom. Boom. A little rattle. That's nice. Okay. Creepiness. That's locked. Alright, time to head to the workshop. Finally. <laughs> Alright. There we go. We made it. In the workshop at last. Oh. I'm breaking stuff. Okay, well. Oh. Huh. Lost it, you deserve finish it. Okay, sure. I'll finish it all right. Is this supposed to be my, my magnum opus? Why can't I open that drawer? Nothing in it. Sweet. Ooh, hello. Uh, that's a lot of brushes. Hmm. Broken glass everywhere. What is, what is all these? Oh. I like this guy's style. Nice. Uh, don't know what I'm doing, don't know what I'm doing, don't know what I'm doing. I'm just looking around. Haha. Uh -huh. So sick and tired of us talking through these notes. We live in the same house, for God's sake. Come talk to me when you're done, before you go to sleep. Oh, shit. Okay, so apparently me and my wife don't get along very well. Uh, I'm just going to guess that she left me. And that's why she's not here. <gasps> or maybe because I'm dead. I don't even have a reflection. That's crazy. That's just... That's nuts. Uh, okay. What the fuck? That ain't right. This isn't my entry hall. What? Tarnation? Hello? What is happening? Oh. Just out of reach. Oh god, shit! Fuck me! <laughs> oh shit! Go! Why you do that to me? What do I what do I do in here? Open all the cabinets and stuff for one. Cause that's just how we do it. No notes, no nothing. Oh hey. This is nice. Man. That made me jump pretty hard. Oh, different way to go. Nice. Now where the hell am I? A place with more cabinets to open. Oh, that must be my wife. Yeah. It's a chilling out playing her piano. Ooh, what's this say? Dear sir and madam, 
We must kindly, albeit strongly, urge you to keep your voices down during the night. Your marital problems, while regretful, are a private matter, and should remain that way. They are certainly of no concern to us, and especially our children. Please consider that not everyone is a freelance artist. Some of us have to get up early and work for a living. We need our sleep. We must also warn you that if things continue the way they are now, we will be forced to call the police. Sincerely, your very tired neighbors. Hmm. <laughs> going in circles. Who's going in circles? Me? Oh, that's nice. Welp. Onward! <laughs>